Okay, here is the latest update of my iPhone grandfather clock. I improved the graphics. I added the gravity power. As you can see, in a real clock, this weight is actually under the clock, way under. So I faked it a little bit with the spinning wheel here. So gravity powered grandfather clock. It actually gives power through the escape wheel, transitioned back from the center of the clock here, of the clock assembly. And naturally this weight doesn't travel this fast. It usually travels uh, the same distance uh, in a matter of a couple of days. Um, we have a minute hand and our hand. Now the timing or the escape wheel controlled by the pendulum, that's where the accuracy comes from. In the center here we have a 16 tooth wheel uh, which uh, tra transforms over to a 60 tooth wheel which is uh, hard connected to a 32 wheel. Uh, I added a magnifying glass so when you run this on the iPhone you can click on the magnifying glass and see the actual transitions here. Then from the 30 wheel so we have a 60 to 30 and the 30 now transitions to another 60 wheel here this one down below here this one and this 60 wheel has in its center a 15 tooth wheel uh, this 15 tooth wheel drives another 60 tooth wheel or the third wheel the third wheel itself has in its center again a 15 tooth connecting to another 60 transition you know for for those who can make quick calculations uh, 15 60 divided by 15 is uh, roughly 4 so that's a 1 to 4 a 1 to 4 a 30 to 60 is a 2 to 1 and the 16 to 60 is a fraction uh, uh, ratio. Nevertheless, on this 60 wheel, uh, on this 60 uh, tooth, uh, on this 60 tooth wheel, we have the movement of one rotation per hour. That is, 60 minutes per hour. From the 60 minutes per hour we take in the center a little eight tooth wheel driving a 30 tooth uh, tooth wheel which is 32 divided by 8 uh, approximately uh, 4 so a 1 to 4 transition and then from the 1 to 4 transition we transit back from a uh, a, 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 a 10 to a, a 10 to a 30 tooth wheel so that's a 3 to 1 which now gives us exactly the 12 hours uh, movement so this one this uh, uh, this 32 wheel, uh, tooth wheel here rotates uh, once every 12 hours now, uh, I, I enhanced the graphics of all the movement. Uh, I added uh, the magnifying glass for better view of you know, the interlocking of the mechanics. Uh, you, know, you can see clearly. And I made, the, I made the clock face more transparent, so you can see more of the movement. Uh, I added the chains, the weight, the pullback chain. I simulated 
uh, that I, I time lapse it a little bit uh, so every 60 seconds you see the weight going down and moving back up. So any second that this is going to happen, uh, here the weight going back up, see, boom, done. Well, that's, that's all. Uh, the new enhanced version of the grandfather clock. I uh, hope you folks enjoy watching this as a preview of the upcoming release of the grandfather clock for the iPhone. Uh, but enjoy watching it on YouTube as a preview. Thank you.